One of the last uh, final words of Jesus when he was on the cross was, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? That is, it's always fascinated me on, on Jesus and as he's on the cross, why would he say God has forsaken him? Well, why don't you come Good Friday? And we're going to look at that a little bit in more details. We're going to look at all the seven last words, but specifically we're going to look at that particular statement. My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? I'm so excited about this service because it's, it involves participation of all of us. We're going to have three stations, a station where we, we think about the sin that we, that we still struggle with, that we want to be nailed to the cross. And we'll have that opportunity to visually nail that to the cross. We're going to have a station to do that. Then we're going to have a time where we partake of the Lord's Supper and we're reminded that Jesus himself died for us. His body was given for us. His blood was shed for us so that we could be in a relationship with him and that he delights to renew us and fill us with his joy, knowing that we're forgiven of that sin that we just nailed to the cross. And then the last station is a time where our elders will come in and pray with you, pray for anything that might be on your heart or mind. So it's gonna be a unique, special time for us to, to join together as a family of God, to be ministered to, uh, uh, to one another as the word is preached, but also as we share with one another our lives in such a way. So come and join uh, Friday, Good Friday service, 7 o'clock. We'd love to see you. Um, God bless.